welcome back to my channel. Uh, welcome back to one of my first grocery hauls of 2022. Um, so I've been to Asda this morning. We did a click and collect just because kids are back at school tomorrow and things. So we needed a couple of bits for lunch boxes. Um, we were all out of fruit pretty much, apart from we've got a couple of apples and pears left. A um, few other bits. We have got quite a lot of meat in the freezer though that we did pick up um, kind of over the Christmas holidays. Um, so we've got loads and loads of meat. So there's not much meat in this, but just needed a couple of other bits to kind of just to make some meals. Um, I will be posting all of my meals of the week from this week on Monday for you. Um, so if you want to watch that, I've also got previous playlists of these. I've got loads and loads of videos now. So go and check those out um, if you want to know what we've had for the week. Um, but I'll just spin you around and show you what we've got. So first of all, I just wanted to show you um, the fruit and veg section. There was a couple of things that I couldn't get, melon being one of them. Um, so I did get some of these just for the kids. Um, instead of having like a whole melon that they take in their lunchbox, we'll just have to take um, a couple of these over the days. We've got some uh, mushrooms as we have some beef left over. So I'm going to make either like a beef curry or like a beef stroganoff type of dish. Um, some raspberries as I just kind of fancied those. These one offer two for two pounds. So I've got blueberries and some grapes. Uh, broccoli for a meal one evening, two cucumbers, just some red onions just for a variety of different things. Uh, lettuce, I just have salad and some bananas. These were the only ones I could get, the bananas in a bag. And I, actually, I think I remember this happening last January. It was really hard to start getting like certain items of fruit and things because everyone starts eating them a lot more. Um, so yeah, I'd normally like man a tiny bit greener than that, but they'll be absolutely fine. The only meat that I did then get this week is just some bacon, um, as that's for a pasta dish that I want to be doing. The rest of the meat for this week, we already have it in the freezer. Um, and then a couple of bits um, just to keep in the freezer for the kids and things for nights that they'll be having something different to us. So um, I saw these, these were on offer. These are popcorn scampi bites. He really likes popcorn chicken, so give those a go. And then just some uh, fish fingers. We needed quite a lot of bread stuff. Um, so we've got some of the pano chocolat for breakfast some golden pancakes and some crumpets some of the ww wraps really good um, for making like homemade pizzas for lunches i find some normal kingsmill 50 50 bread and then i went for some of these bake at home baguettes just because we have a few um kind of odds and sods of veg left which i thought i could try and make a soup um and then i thought we could have that maybe one evening just with a kind of bake at home baguette um, and that would make sort of a really easy kind of dinner for the fridge section, um, a lot of this stuff is, like I said, lunch boxy food. So some of the um, fruby type things, some of the fridge raiders chicken, these are only one point each on the WW plan. Some yogurts for the kids, we need some more butter. Some of these uh, baby bell lights, these are also only one point each. A couple of yogurts and things for me and Chris. Um, so as to do these ones, it's the only place that I've seen that they do them. So these are the Muller Light Cookie Dough flavoured yogurts. Um, I think these are about three points each. I've got two of those, one for each of us. And then some of these, uh, Lindar's Protein Pudding. If you haven't tried the uh, Kavag, they're, they're quite expensive, but they are really, really good. They're only two points um, per tub. And then they've recently just bought these ones out as well. So they do a vanilla flavour, which basically just tastes exactly like custard. And the chocolate one. I could only get the chocolate one today, so I've got two of those. Um, and then these are also on offer at the moment in Asda, a variety of different flavours. These are the Muller, are they Muller? No, they're not Muller, they're just light and free. Um, Greek style yoghurt, this is the white chocolate flavour. And these are one point each, and they do a couple of other different ones. Cherry Bakewell, strawberry, sticky toffee, that type of thing. Um, some smoothies for the kids, some hand wash, a tin of spaghetti cubes for Rosie just for lunch one day. We needed some more garlic, so I thought I would give this one a go. The minced garlic paste, as this was only about £1.10 or something, so really good value. A couple of yo-yo bears um, just for lunch boxes. These are on offer at the moment. Some passata to make meatballs. We've got um, some turkey meatballs in the freezer. Um, like I said, our freezer is absolutely full, so we need to eat out of the freezer this week. So we're going to have those and some tomato puree. Some ham for the kids' sandwiches and things. Um, some chocolate slices. These are the 30% less sugar one. I think these are four smart points each. Quavers for the kids and two packs of Diet Coke. So that is everything uh, that we've got for the week. Like you can see most of the stuff for like kids' lunch boxes, um, a couple of bits of yogurt, that type of thing. And then just stuff to kind of make up the meals that we've already got in the freezer. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you again in another one very soon. Bye. <coughs>